The islands have always attracted artists because of the beauty of the landscape. Wild beauty at its best, really. I founded this company way back in 1976 with my wife Anya, and we've grown it from there in a Schmal knitting company. I love the idea of the restrained worker. Everybody talks about the iron fisherman sweater knitted by his wife. Oh, that's the white sweater that we saw on Steve McQueen wearing or whoever. But in fact, that was Sunday best. The iron fisherman sweater was far more restrained. There is much more to the repertoire of the iron knitter than the highly decorated sweater. Most of the men here want to go to sea. They want to be fishing. It's kind of like inbred in them. I came here in the late 70s. I was amazed by the philosophy of the older people here. We talked to all the knitters, they all learned it from their mothers at a very young age, and they were part of this little craft industry that was churning out sweaters week by week. Maureen is an expert knitter. She's been doing it for 50, 60 years. Been organizing all of this craft industry in the islands for the merchants who used to export to America and Japan way, way back when the small little craft industry started up. We're always sitting down with the knitters and finding out what they used to do, talking about patterns and trying to bring them into what we do. The modern machinery has huge potential and we push those machines to their limits. We put yarns on that people wouldn't dream of knitting. It means that we have to have a very skilled workforce. The skill of finishing the garment is enormous. Each piece is knitted as a piece. Uh, you may have four, five, six panels, depending on whether it's a sweater or a cardigan, all put together with a trim, linked on, stitch for stitch, to create the garment. And then there's hand finishing afterwards, pulling in all the threads, and very often little, little details on neck bands and so on. In the Autumn Winter 17 collection, we decided to have a go at doing a new modern fisherman's sweater. What would a, a modern fisherman's wife knit for her husband? We designed what was essentially a very technically difficult sweater to make. A lot of extra work in the factory, but it was a huge success. It was worldwide acclaimed. We had people coming looking for it all over the place. And we're always looking at the landscape. The landscape is changing daily. More and more nowadays, I seem to be seeing things that I didn't see before. I think it, as you get on in life, you begin to realize things that you'd sort of scoot past maybe when you were younger. I'm looking at the landscape, the fields, and at the seashore all of the time. 